Hey guys, welcome to Infantry Outdoors. Look who's in the back seat. Brandon! And over here, my buddy Jay. He's going to be working the cameras today. So today we're off to the War Memorial Auditorium. we got to Google it how to get there. War Memorial Auditorium. And then uh, we're actually going to the gun show. So we're going to be checking it out, talking to some vendors, getting to meet and greet the people. And I want to find out uh, you know, different questions for us about uh, what different things I can find that will help the disabled in the outdoors. Um, I do a lot of shopping here at this, this gun show, to be honest with you. Um, but we're going to be taking you there with us today. I got Little Monkey with us. Like I said, Big J is helping out with the camera work today, and I really appreciate it. And uh, well, we're just go cool. check it out, have some fun, check out some knives, check out some guns. Let me see if I can find some things that will benefit us in the outdoors while I'm at the gun show. You know, my buddy Jay here, for those that are just tuning in or have never seen him before, Jay and I go way, 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 way back. Way back. Way back. And um, very good friend, is always taking good care of me and my family and vice versa. Long time friend. Um, you know, Jay's always been aware of my disability. And, you know, he's one of the people that has always encouraged me to do stuff like this. So that's why he's here with me today. So, Jay, we love you, bro. Love Big you thumbs too. up on YouTube. So, you know. Give Jay a big thumbs up. Awesome guy. Um, you know, we're riding through the town of Davie right now. We got to go 595 eastbound. So I just took a moment to wanted to introduce you guys to Jay. And uh, well, it's a car ride. I actually work up over here. There's my check cashing store right here. I'm big into where I live, guys. I do a lot of business and I, I support everybody in my neighborhood and in my town. And here in the town of Davie, uh, you know, I got my checks cash at the check cash in store. I go over here, and I'm not supported or, or sponsored by anybody, so you guys are aware of this. All of these videos are on me. I come out of my pocket, and they come from support from you guys. So remember to go to my patron page. Uh, that's patreon.com slash infantry outdoors. And you guys can be a supporter of the show, and we really appreciate it because we got a lot of things coming up. A lot of things that we want to do, and like I say, this is all by me, so all of the episodes and everywhere you see me film, I am not paid by the places I go to. I go to these places to bring you guys events and things for people like us to do, so keep that in mind. Um, so when you see me at big places like where we're going today, the gun show, they did not pay me in any way. I'm doing this because I always go to the gun show, so I'm going to bring it to you guys, my view of it and how I feel, and you know, like I said, try to find products and things that we can use. Um, to help us outdoors, whether it's knives, firearms, fire starters. We got a lot of cool things. Have you ever been to that gun show before? Nope. Oh, look, first time. <laughs> Brandon and I know what to expect, right, Brandon? Yeah. Yeah, what? Lots, lots of guns. And what else is there? Lots of people, right? Yep. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of people there. <laughs> so, we're, like I said, man, we're cutting through the town of Davie here, headed towards 595. Nova Southeastern University is to my left. You know, here, I think that's going to be left on screen. Um, yeah. Some of my viewers actually go to Nova. Big up Nova Southeastern University. And we're just, like I said, man, we're cruising. We're getting ready to go. Yeah, taking Jay. Right yeah, it's raining in some parts. So it makes it hard to get outdoors. You guys know this weekend's kind of been an indoor event weekend. Um, so that's why we're going over here. It's something to do indoors for a little bit that is outdoors. So, yeah.
Hey guys, right. we're here at the War Memorial Auditorium. We're getting ready to go inside the gun show. We just got here. I'm gonna go meet with Morgan and get all of our checking stuff. Always hold hands with the grown-ups. Yeah, good, good. Don't get hit by a car. That's what I learned from my teacher. Now for Jay, this is his first time. Brandon and I already know what to expect. So. Maybe they got a new gun selling out of here yet. We're in line. It's nice and air conditioning, right? It's hot today, guys, in Florida. It's really, really hot today in Florida. Daddy, there's one person on the next Thank you. Okay, thank you. Look at this, guys. This is, my son wants me to get one of these, so I asked him, Brandon, what are we going to go hunt? Elephant? An elephant. This is insane, guys. These are the kind of things you can find a shoot strip. I don't want to pull it too hard because the little stringy thing will sound the alarm. But they got a lot of cool things that shoot straight. Check them out. It's in the description below. Let's keep going. Look at this. Awesome. Look at the stock on it. Your hand fits perfectly in here. So far, so far we've seen like three or four guns from the video game. So it's, Brandon's having a real fun time with it. It's really cool. Yeah, it's from so. my video game called Deer Hunter 2017. Like I say, another good thing about the folks here at Shoot Straight, and a lot of the places too, if you ask them, is when you buy something like this and you want it set up a certain way, they'll take the time to actually. What are you going to do? What are you going to hunt? What are you going to shoot? How are you going to shoot? And work with you to get the best optics, the best things that you need, whether it's a, a butt pad to take some of the recoil off, mounts for your chairs, whatever it might be. The folks at Shoot Straight will definitely help you out and definitely take the time to get it done. So big ups to the crew, man. Hey, they're doing good things. And as you see, there's a lot of cool guns. So check out Shoot Straight. Hello. How are you doing today? Daddy. How are you doing? Doing good, doing good. Hey guys, so I'm at one of my favorite vendors. Brandon and I have been eating this stuff for years. Like I said, Brandon's been coming to this gun show since he was a baby. And herkyjerky.com <laughs> and this is the new the new one or the long the new about three years about yeah. three years now go ahead and introduce yourself to everybody on YouTube yeah my name is Jason and uh, herkyjerky.com we do elk buffalo venison beef bacon and uh, we, you know we've been doing it for 25 years everything is uh, farm raised animals and made the opportunities that means it's good for you and we and they don't go slaughter do nothing bad so conservation key there herky jerky they're doing it up guys the, their jerky's off the chain every year we come here we get some so make sure you check them out another one of the great vendors like i said they don't go on slaughter they do it all nice nice fresh that's why we buy it right so stay tuned we're gonna be checking out more vendors here at the 2017 full Lauderdale international gun show so keep it tuned jerky guys like i said we we'll always get it when we come see Brandon and I got how is it? It's awesome. It tastes a little salty. No salty, that's good. Jerky close to a little salty. Work behind you. Not letting people pass. But it's really good, guys. Look. Herkyjerky.com. Check them out. I've been eating at them every time we come here, man, for years. So check them out.
check out what I found here at the gun show. Check out the counter. I'm going to kind of stand here so we can't shoot past me. Yeah. Uh, research and development purposes only, okay? But check this stuff out here. I want you guys to look at this. My man here has come up with a great idea. And we were just talking. I saw his products here on the table. A lot of us are fishermen here. Of course, we live in Florida. We do a lot of fishing. We do a lot of scuba. We do a lot of free diving. So, he's got a lot of cool products here. And I'm going to have him introduce his company here to let you guys know what he's all about. But for the spear fishermen, whether you have a disability or you don't, these are really cool. I'm going to let him introduce the company. Go ahead. How are you doing? My name is Stephen Powell with Engineer uh, by Sound. Uh, POW doesn't mean prisoners of war. This is my last name. I just took off the aisle. Um, I am a home uh, based business that grew to a phenomenal company. Uh, a lot of my items I do have for. I used to make generally 100% because of the growth of the business. I'm making 20%. And I just want to introduce you to some of the items I have that can be very beneficial to you. Uh, to start with, here, yeah, the slingshots. Uh, these are naturopathical slingshots that we grew up with, uh, you know, the wrist rockets you're familiar with. Uh, these are a little more advanced now, a little more convenient, more easier. Uh, for instance, this long contraption here with the rails, this was designed in, in, in designed to make uh, slingshot more enjoyable and easier. Uh, now it's all foot based instead of actually pulling and drawing back with your head in case you have arthritis or other uh, slight conditions where you can't draw back with such sanctions. And the way this operates, Right now, currently, I have a cable on it that's set for a spear, for spear fishing. That's what's on it right now. But you can also change the bands if you just want to shoot ball bearings and target shooting hit, hit rods. The way this works is there's a sort of uh, kind of mousetrap mechanism that when you release it, it allows you to be able to give you discharge. Now, when you hit the trigger, it opens up your claw that allows you to capture the slingshot, which is the slingshot bow. Now when you're ready to charge it, you use your feet, so you don't have to use your hand. At this point, it uh, can accommodate from one band up to 12 bands, all at once, that type of power. Wow. And then the, and the, you'll see, you see the uh, extension here of the metal, that's where you charge your feet with. And when you're charging <laughs> it down, I'm going to use my hand. Okay, because that's two bands. But basically, you're doing that with your feet. And he did that with his hand, yeah. so that should give you an indication of it's not really that difficult. Yeah, yeah. And I don't want to discharge this on you really quickly. And this one next to it is very similar. Uh, similar design. This actually looks like a slingshot. Yeah. This one looks like the old school days of the wrist rod. Exactly, exactly, exactly. And this one is the same thing too. But also too, when these bands come off and you want to use this band on it, they also have these type of bands that look similar to this, but they're thin. Um, okay. Using the medical hospitals for you know taking them to go above. Right, right. That's what they have now. Now, when you're using those bands, those bands are standing much longer. Right. So when you're using that band, you have to release this to extend it out to this extent. Oh. That, that extends the band to that distance. Now you got a, yeah. a monster fish yeah. on the line. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that is really cool. Right. These are just the slingshots. And here's some other ones here that if you are um, <coughs> able to manage it with your hand, uh, this one has a basically a sight on it, uh, optics on it. You can uh, adjust the windage, the elevation. That's good for someone like me with a visual yeah. impairment. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, basically right. if you want to be a sniper with a slingshot, this is absolutely the top of the notch here. All handmade by your children. Uh, this one here is a catapult I'm a version. Uh, four springs, lots of power. Um, you got a brace here, uh -huh. so you don't hurt your wrist. So it kind of makes it a wrist rocket. And so you guys squirrel hunting up north, uh -huh. think about it, okay? A quick way to take a squirrel out with one shot. Uh -huh. And this was a similar setup, but your hand goes up and under. And um, this one actually moves comfortably with your hand. So you can actually still pitch your target without actually moving your whole wrist. That's Maybe for moving or losing your wrist in certain situations may be painful for you. This allows you just to move the band by itself. So it's a big advantage on this one. Now, if you want to step it up a little bit of a notch, we have here, this one shoots 30 caliber ball bearings, same ball bearings as slingshot. And it's charged through air, same way with your hand. Just you cup it down with your hand, and you'll be able to shoot 30 caliber ball bearings. Now that, for my folks that are in wheelchairs, this might be something that you'd be able to use or to do, because it's, I mean, it's so easy that he's doing it right in the table. Uh -huh. That easy. And um, this... One light piece, very really aluminum, easy backpack, and it all breaks down too. It's all to us now and break down for easy things and easy to fight that. So all maintain yourself. And I'm screwing this by hand, you know? And um, so it's just to show you that you can transport this and put this in a bug out bag or just have fun in your yard.
Now, the predecessor to this, the, which I didn't want to mention earlier, show, but since I will, for all you fishers out there, this is my grill gun. That's what I named it. Designed to take a bow fishing, make can be. Uh, uses a tank of air, which is empty, that's in the handle, hidden, and there's a built in pump that will get to it. You get this under your feet, and you just pressurize it to whatever uh, application you want. For me personally, I wouldn't go past two for bow fishing. Right. Uh, right. You, wanna, no. you don't want to go through. You don't want to go through the going. Absolutely. Uh, if you want a target shoot and you stand up arrows that I just said, you can pressurize it up and go some distance and yard it on it. And that's just Zepco, a great brand of uh, uh, direct mount uh, fishing reel. The line's it's a great line, it's 200 pounds. And um, it's pretty badass. That's you know? really cool. That yeah. is badass. Uh, now, for someone like. Now, he builds these himself, so if yeah. you guys need something. Different, like I'm gonna ask you here if I wanted to get this, could you put a scope on it for me? Yes. Could you modify it Absolutely. specifically for my needs, being your builder? Yes. And then we talked about that before, and I think that's really great. Yeah. Is that he'll help you guys out depending on what you're gonna do. As a lot of the folks you see that I've interviewed here today, they're willing to go that extra mile to get us to get be able to Absolutely. use the products, to be able to get outdoors. And I, I mean, hey, I think it's great, man. I'm gonna be checking you guys out. How can we find you on the web? Uh, you can find me at engineeringbypow.com, E-N-I-E-N-G-I-N-E-E-R-E-B, by Pow, B-Y-P-O-W. And I'm also on Instagram on the Fancy Beasts, kind of like the cat's food, Fancy Feast, but Fancy Beasts. Now check them out today, guys, because like I said, the products here, they really make it available for a wide range of product things, especially... Bow fishing gone, gone mad. That's what you put yes, call that one. Bow fishing gone mad. <laughs> and you so, make a lot of these yourself, yes, right? Yes, I do. Here at Cold Springs, Florida. And he, okay. he's locally here, yeah. Florida, guys. So. And you can give back to the community, this gentleman. Hard work and taking care of family, making <laughs> stuff. Yeah, we got That's it. a good thing for you. Yep, yep, it is. So make sure you guys check him out. He's here locally in Cold Springs. And these are great, great products that I think will help you guys out a lot. Check him out. Follow him on Instagram. And check out his webpage as well, guys. So we're going to keep shopping. And uh, thanks again, man. Thank you, man. This is really cool. We're wrapping up here. We found a lot of cool products, as you guys seen. And that's how it always is here. That's why I come to the gun show. Because to be honest with you, they got a lot of different products and stuff that we can use. You are the winner. I am the winner. You are. Just keep hey. open eyes. Hi, friend. Your friend is Say the winner. Say hi. Hi, YouTube. Are you doing? talking to yourself? No, no. This is a YouTube. YouTube. Say hi. Are you on YouTube? Uh, no. Is your organization on YouTube? This, How about Facebook, Instagram? Are you Facebook. Guys? Well, let everybody know where you are. My name is Flatbush Dolly. Holla at me. There you go. Hey, Have guys. a great day. Like I said, guys, we've had a lot of fun here today, a lot of great interviews. Found a lot of cool products that are going to help you guys out, out in the outdoors. I knew we would. So we're going to get out of here and attempt to go back to do that fishing episode we started before it started raining. So, oh, what a good time, man. Mr. J, how did you like it? I loved it. What was your favorite part of the... Well, come here. Let's tell the people. How did you like the episode? You know what we did? I loved it. It was pretty cool? Yeah. What was your favorite thing you saw? Um, the harpoon gun. The har yeah, that harpoon gun was pretty kick-ass, guys. <laughs> you got a favorite one? What's your favorite one? The machine Or you mean the flamethrower, right? That's the one that you like? Yeah, we got to see a flamethrower. That was pretty pretty cool, guys. No, we have to buy that one. It shoots out fire. It does. They, they have a flamethrower in there. No joke. So like I said, guys, a lot of the vendors here at the War Memorial Auditorium are here to help us get outdoors. I want to thank everybody for participating. I'll put in the description to the people we interviewed today in the links. And uh, we just had a great time. So I want to thank to the gun show, the Full Lauderdale gun show. Uh, Morgan and everybody, thank you very much for all that you did, allowing us access and everything. So we're going to get out of here, guys. Until next time, I hope this inspires you to get outdoors, use these products, and they will. So we're out of here, guys. See ya.